Hey, welcome back. It's your host, Neil. I hope everybody's doing good. We have been gone for a while. I haven't touched our sector in, I, I think, two, three months, maybe. Um, but we are jumping back into it, and today we are going to be uh, busting the hive, hopefully. Uh, we're definitely going to be doing Iron Man mode. Let's just do a normal galaxy. Uh, we are going to keep uh, the regular core world, because it just works better with Hiver. I've uh, read and found a little bit. Uh, and then we are going to just proceed. We are going to do our own free start. Uh, let's get a small combat. We have a couple mods enabled. Nothing too wild, but also uh, a couple decent ones. We have a, kind of like a industrial evolution light, still Nexorim. Ships and weapons pack, uh, the two times speed. All the, the usual fun ones. Uh, we're just going to jump in. The, the hope for us on this particular run is I, I really want to kind of test out what, what the Hive can do. I haven't fought them more than a handful of times. Um, and I want to see if we can get a nice fleet, maybe even a colony up before they, they really start moving into the galaxy. Uh, so let's go ahead and just correct all these positions. Uh, transfer. Nope. Let's go. You know let's do interdiction pulse first, and then the jump. I think that'll be good for us. Uh, so we are going to be starting out. It looks like in the Persian League sector, uh, and here's the hivers way out here. My understanding, and from what I've seen a little bit, is they kind of expand inward, uh, and we'll have, we'll eventually start sending ships and everything at us. Uh, so let's let's uh, let's see if we, we can't take that on. We are going to be starting out with, uh, looks like a couple ships, nice ones. Got a Vanguard, uh, pretty decent. They don't have shields, but they do have that, that fun damper effect. Um, we have a Nautilus, always always a nice. Looks like we've got Auto Missile Loader in, so we might just leave what's there. And we have the Beholder. Um, I don't have too much experience with this one, I'll be honest. Uh, so we may change all of this. In fact, let's just take a quick look at its stats. And its description. Okay, so we have ray drones. We've got two medium synergy, a couple small energy. We have a decent maintenance cost here for it being a destroyer. Omni shield, not very good armor, but the whole integrity is decent, and so is the shield arc. It looks like. All right, and of course the other items we have are the Nautilus starting out. Uh, this one's pretty, pretty small, uh, and then our Vanguard. Uh, yeah, gotta gotta appreciate the, the the Vanguard. They can be, they can be tough little blocks, uh, but it's it's set up quite terribly. The, as we've learned, uh, the light assault cannon's pretty much garbage. That might be different with the um, Hivers, because uh, just having looked at a couple of their stats and ships, they I think we're going to have to favor missiles and anti-armor. Uh, they don't have much in the way of shields, uh, but they're 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 tough tough to crack. All right, let's see what we've got going on. A uh, couple, couple extra ships, nothing crazy. A couple Shepherds. The Owl Star is fine. It's like a little, little baby eagle. Uh, and it performs por pretty poorly, honestly, for a frigate. We do have uh, a couple items here. We could give this guy a frigate. He might be able to get us. Targeted ship. Ooh, we could get us a Heron right off the bat if we can... Nah, uh, 29,000 credits. Nope, we don't have enough. And then... Nah, we don't care about the rest of that. We're, we're not nearly ready for those, uh, those bounty boards. What we might do, though... See, let's use the Janus device. We're skipping the. This is some of the uh, the new items that are added in with the. Uh, I forget what it's called, and I feel really bad. I'll try to make sure I put that mod in the description. You know what? Let's just find out what that mod's called real quick. It'll mute it while I'm checking. It is Ashes of the Domain, I think. Is that it? For which industry? Ooh, I'll just add a, a list of what's currently enabled. Uh, kind of like an industry light. Adds a little bit more to the colony management side of things. Alright, efficiency overhaul. Nope, 
Don't think we're gonna care about efficiency this time around. <laughs> oh, I do really like the plasma flamers. They're kind of they're kind of a lot of fun. Okay, what'd that guy at the uh, the board want? Give the gaudy inspector. Requirements frigate. So we could give up what we have now. However, there's good chance we can just purchase one of these garbage ships. Yeah, yeah. Then go back in. Should be able to give the kite and make just a little bit of credit off of it. Perfect. Now let's see if there's anything actually worth buying. So we could get another Nautilus if we wanted a couple extra face skippers. Um, got a pair of wolves here. We wouldn't be able to load them out. Oof. I think we're just going to have to move on. We might even take a commission really early on to, uh, yeah, we might might just take a commission really early on. Let's see if there's anything worth selling in this own system. This is a pretty cheap place to be buying water, but nowhere's buying it yet. Volatiles, 197, not really worth it, of course. Yeah, so I don't think we're going to be selling anything in system here. That's a bit of a shame. We should probably stock up on some crew, but this is a really expensive place to do it. The fuel is not terrible. Yeah. Maybe supplies. We'll just grab a couple supplies here and we'll, we'll move on. I think we might need to grab a, a quick commission, I think. I think we're going to want to get as much money as we can as quickly as we can. Being tracked by nearby patrol. Yeah, do not care. Goodbye. I think we can get a commission pretty quick. We can start getting some money flowed in. So let's check in here. Ooh, requires 10 favorable. We do not have anything currently with them. Uh, more rectifacts, <laughs> natural resource found by biochemicals, carbohydrates, hydrocarbons. Sorry, carbohydrates. Uh, the, the, the humble reflex reactor generator molecule. See, interesting. And then we have also biotics, and it looks like we've got water again, and it looks like it's actually finally popping up too, in, in some other areas. Good. All right. Well, let's uh see what we can get here then. Honestly, if it wasn't for the price of the Wayfarer, that would not be terrible. Ah, uh, Hammerhead for 20000 Sorry, cannot buy it. Yeah, we, we definitely don't want to be going after these, these bounties yet. Uh, let's see. Ooh. Capable private military contractors against Hegemy. See, that could be really bad. Um... Yeah, we're going to have to skip that for right now. We need a little bit better fleet so we can either escape or uh, actually take a couple fights. Let's see what bounties are open. System bounties specifically. Against Pirates, Lotus Path, and Hivers. So I think we're going to Habristle real quick. It seems to be the closest one. And it should be open for a little while. At least I thought it was. Uh, Tritachion. Yeah, 45 days, so we should have plenty of time. Can you guys, like, leave us be? That'd be great. It's been a while, so this should be interesting. Uh, trying to figure out what we've done. So maybe we'll be joining Tritachion, since they'll be the ones giving us uh, relationship points as we blast out pirates and the like. Yep, that's fine. That looks okay, too. Let's pull up this way, because, yeah, we already got hit like fools. And we'll jump on in. All right. Where are they going? Okay. Sometimes they'll give you an obvious cue where some of the uh, pirates and everything will be. Got another Nautilus there, but they're... They're... I mean, they, their description kind of says it all. They're just really expensive little freighters. 
Yeah. Let's see if there's anything going on in here we can get some extra money out of. Yeah, no, let's let's avoid these pirate tron tracks. Uh, we've got a spy. Yeah, no. Well, if you kill me out, 65 credits per unit for heavy machinery. That can be a pretty good price. We'll uh, we'll see if there's anywhere. No, we we are not going to be able to fight a powerful fleet. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the the taking the investment credits can be bad. Let's see exactly how powerful this fleet is. You know what? Let's do it. Because <laughs> we could just let the, the Star Fortress fight them all. <laughs> as long as we don't get caught by the fleet, the Star Fortress should do all the fighting for us. Along with anything just like kind of chilling here in orbit. Yeah, there's the first one. There's the second one. Yeah, yeah, this should be a, an absolute nightmare. Holy crap, I didn't think I realized they'd all be hitting us at the same exact time. Hold on, let's see if we can't get anything out of this fleet. We should be able to get a little bit of cash. Um, oh man, there's nothing here, is there? I mean, again, another Nautilus. Let's at least refit our ships. I think the proximity charge is nice, but what else, other options do we have here? Yeah, so I'm pretty sure the point defense is probably fine, but let's go ahead and pull it all off just to see so they have nothing else going on here. Wow. All right, undo that. Um, we have a little light phase lance. This comes from the ship and weapons pack. And again, there are zero additional options here. Wow. Okay, I didn't realize we were so poorly equipped. This is no... This has no capabilities of destroying enemy ships. And again, we don't really have any options here. Wow, okay. This was potentially a terrible move. Uh, expanded missile rack, that's good for the harpoons. Insulated engine assembly is probably useless. Do we have the missile autoloader? We do not. Okay, that would have been nice. Um, uh, this is going to be as good as it gets, I think, right there. I think the only thing we can change really is ours. These proximity mines are fine, but they're not going to... I don't think they're going to do us any good right now. We could get rid of expanded missile racks, switch this out to... No, the heavy blasters are going to cost us way too much. Might just have to do pulse. Ooh, you know what? Do they have the integrated targeting system here? Because that'd be really handy right now. Oh, crap. They do not. They do have the ECCM package. We might think about that afterwards. Oh, this is... This could be... This could have been a terrible mistake on my part. Yeah, I think this was a bad... Bad idea. This was a terrible idea. Get the rid of expanded missile racks. Bump out our vents all the way. No. Probably our capacitors. Yeah, this is almost entirely useless on this. Oh, this was a terrible idea. Why did I do this? Alright, let's just see if we can't help. We're not going to be able to, but let's see if we can do it. You know what? Nope. Let's just uh, let's just put defense on the starship. Wow. Yeah, I haven't I haven't played in a long time too, so this this should be really bad. <laughs> okay, so we're looking looking to have start pretty nice. I'm okay with that. Like I said, the star fortress is probably gonna do all the work, especially Tritachions.
make sure our shields get up real quick. Ugh. Yeah, we don't want to be hitting the gremlins. Let us vent real fast. Oh yeah, we made a mistake. We made a grand mistake. You know, those heavy blasters are looking really good right now. Let's bust out the raid drones. We're still venting. Keep it going. There goes those mines. We gotta watch out we don't get caught by them though. Let's get a vent. Hold on. Okay. We're gonna try to focus on the ones trying to hit the star fortress. It's the only ones we're gonna be able to really really do any damage against. Try to use the gremlin right here to keep a uh, keep some sort of protection on our side. But we're going to get caught right here between the mule. Yeah, this is a bad idea. Oh, we got pulled back. I gotta deal with this mule because it keeps coming for us. As long as it keeps its shields towards the Star Fortress, we'll be better off, but uh, this is not a good day for us. Come on, Star Fortress. There we go. Keep, keep getting some damage in. Let's zoom forward. See if we can't help again. Yep, yeah, let the ray guns do some damage. Great. Hey, brawler, get out of my way. See if we can't take out the little Nautilus. Get rid of this uh, archer, I think it's called. Get around the gremlin. Nope, too early. There we go. Alright, come on. Good, another one down. See if we can't kill it. Come on, come on, come on. Get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it. There we go. Let's go ahead and vent real quick. Pull back. Alright, we're doing fine, I think. We're doing better than I expected, to be honest. Let's see if we can't get this condor. Uh, our point defense is working overtime. Yep, get it, get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Alright, got a vent. Pull back. Just a little bit, though. Let's go ahead and target the gremlin. Hopefully our rays will be able to take most of it. Yep. Good, good, good. Get it. Perfect. Alright. Shields back up.
Got another little gremlin right here. It'll have to come out in a second. Blast it. Come on, come on, target it. Raise, get it. Come on. Come on. Alright, Starfort just did all the job here. Starts pre-shooting. Nice. Alright, let's see if we can't chase things down. But let's go ahead and uh, turn that off. For Star Fortress at this point is just fine. They're going to try to retreat. So we're going to try to take out a couple of these condors. Should be able to. As soon as we get through the armor in the back, we'll start chunking it. There we go. Make sure we're not too close. Woo! Hold up, hold up. Pull it back. Their, their fighters are starting to get us again. There we go. Ah, uh, too close to the mines. Too close, too close, too close, too close, too close. Alright, nice job. You know what, full salt. Throw us in the little Nautilus. Uh, okay, I think that was that. Yep. Woo! <laughs> Holy crap. Honestly, I'm surprised we got it. Uh, what we probably should do is scrap all this. But we're going to scrap everything down there. So what I want is to get all of these and, re and just sell them out straight. Perfect. So before we ate it again, because there's, there's still another fleet right here. Let's... Holy bananas. Do we want to scuttle it? Or do we want to sell it? Well, let's just look real quick. Do any of these ships have any real... No, none of these ships actually have too much on them. A couple little items, but I think mostly we're just going to sell it all. Yeah, let's just sell it. Fleet. And then... What's the command for sell? S. Nice. Got us character skill point too. Uh, I think we're going to try to focus on our fleets this time. So let's let's get all combat ships damage. And yeah, I think that'll that'll work. Hold on, repair our ships. Do we need more crew? We are surprisingly still okay on crew. Let's just go ahead and help finish off the, the enemy here. Uh, we're going to do a full assault. Uh, I don't even think we're going to catch anything. Nope, that was it. That was fast. Yeah, we didn't get hardly anything there. We might be able to catch those other ships here in just a second. But let's see if we can't... Can't, A, I mean, get rid of all this garbage we can't keep right now. We'll sell that, just for fun. All the fuel we can sell, and let's take a look at what ships we've got. We got 130,000, and I think we've probably got plenty of support, I mean, uh, relations now with Tritachion to be able to take a commission with them. Let's see, what do we want? What do we want? What do we want? Tempest is, Tempest is really nice, but I think we need some larger ships. I'm really tempted to get the Fury. There's really not a lot here. Are we at the military base or are we at the regular? No, okay, so we want to go to the military base.
Let's grab something anyways. Because, uh... If we try to hunt down these ships with what we've got right now, we might not be able to do it. Well, everyone knows I do like a mule. I don't think there's a whole lot of difference between the regular and the... Uh, I guess one medium universal technically is the difference. Uh, probably some other items too. I mean, there's increased maintenance over there. But I think... Yeah, I think we're going to go with the pirate. I'd like to get the gremlin. But I think we need to... Hold off on some of those those nicer ships. <laughs> nicer ship is a gremlin. That's not not normally what we would say, is it? All right. So the pulse laser, I think, was a terrible idea. We probably should have stuck with uh, st stuck with maybe phase lance as a proximity launcher. But I think we're gonna be okay with what we've got here. Let's go ahead and throw. You know, I'm really tempted to put the, the the Reaper on this. What do we have here that we can put on? Da, 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 da. Iron Torpedo is not a terrible choice. Honestly, especially with uh, especially with the Typhon, we might be that might be our preference, anyways. Let's go ahead and make sure this is useful for us. Uh, we are going to. Yeah, as a pirate ship. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Let's make sure we have expanded cargo holds. Let's give it reinforced bulkhead. Um, we're not going to need a whole lot of weapon flux, but we can go ahead and cap out. And yeah, okay. I think that'll be fine. This is still, yeah, this is still the same. Really nothing we can do here. And that's basically the same too. Do we have a good captain here we might be able to use? No? But can we get commission? Yes, we can. All right. All right, so hold up. What do we got here? Stay out of identified fleet. Let's see if we can't get this one. It's on our way where we need to be anyways, and I just realized we are missing a bunch of crew. But that's okay. It looks like we're not going to have to actually manually fight this. Nope, don't want any of that. Let's go ahead over to Kulan. Let's make sure we've got a nice burn going. Let's see if we can't buy some actual useful ships here. Holy crap, the Zenith. Uh, I almost wish we had enough cash for it. I've done the ships and weapons mod once. The Zenith was a lot of fun. see anything going on here uh, for a hundred thousand that would have been perfect hold on we might be able to afford that anyways sell 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 it's just only two grand shoot they have excess stockpile of that that only gets us a little bit Sell all of our fuel. Actually, sell it on the black market, too. They'll get us just enough. And, yeah, we'll we'll take your heavy cruiser. Timid point defense? You know, this is really odd for a pather to join us. Um, usually, they're hyper-aggressive. Are we... Oh, no, no, no. Two fleets containing this? Absolutely not. Although, maybe. How incredible it would be to be able to secure this executor right off the bat. It should have two fleets containing 41 ships with a combined strength of 420 points. 
for comparison, your ships have 47, haha. <laughs> then our battle station has 384. Your mission is to defeat the enemy ships. I think... Honestly, I think this battle station should be able to take it. We're going to decline it for just a second. Um, as we try to figure out what we could afford. Oh my goodness. We can't afford anything. We'll never, yeah, we're never going to get up to that total. What would we, what would we need? We would need a lot. Oh boy, uh, I think we made a mistake. You know what? Hold on, let's do this. So we have enough crew. If we drop some of these vessels. And then we could also, if we wanted to, refit this boy with some of the other equipment we have. Oh, we don't have nearly enough, though, to, to be refitting this. Okay, so this is just going to have to sit in the background for right now. As we deal with the, the rest of it. Oh, it would have been a lot of fun, though. Hold on. No, we can't even... Yeah, we can't even buy uh, storage yet, because we, we need 5,000 credits to do so. Hold on. Let's get our... Torsair uh, rate, 25% armor damage, recover ships. Where do we want? Ooh. Yeah, we definitely want that. Uh -huh, this was a bad idea. Oh boy, this was a bad idea. Maybe not, though. What the heck are you doing? You were going to recover them? Because then we can immediately sell them. Engaged in battle. Patrolling. Okay, yeah, I think this was the best opportunity we... I mean, best uh, outcome we could have had. Sell. Sell. I mean, it really doesn't give us a whole lot. But what we can do now... Is because they... Yeah, they like, we drew in this extra fleet. Um, we should be able to help take this. The Zenith just has to stay. There's no option, no other option. We need a little bit of crew. And that's all we can afford. All right, Zenith has to stay, but the rest of it can come. Uh, you know, I kind of want the Vanguard and the Mule. Did I forget my own ship? I sure did. Crap. Alright, I guess we're gonna take over this one. Forgot our own ship, guys. Alright, so we are absolutely gonna be on the defense now. But, I think we got this. Yeah, I need to turn off the flash again. Not what I meant to do. Wrong items. Yep, take it down. Get it, Vanguard. Get it, 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 get it. Okay, good. I don't have to waste a torpedo on it. 
Alright, torpedoes are one. We don't... We don't want to be wasting our reapers on these little vessels. We need to get around. Maneuvering jets. Perfect. Alright, we're already out of the uh, torpedoes. So we're just gonna have to wait for the shields to go down. Which we might be able to assist by bashing. Got him. Let's bash him again. Let's just keep bashing him. Maneuvering jets. Go, go, go. Ram it. There we go. Alright, vent. I really want that vessel. If we could get that vessel by just Typhon re reaping it, it would be great. Holy crap! Shields up. We're too close to that condor. Enemies behind us too. I missed that entirely. Oh shoot. We were just a little early. Hold on, can we bring our other ship in yet? Okay, we can bring the Nautilus in. I mean, I'd rather that happen. Full assault. Nice! Ah, and we missed out on it. That's too bad. But we'll do the same thing. We'll go ahead and take all these so we can resell them. Go back real quick. Salvage absolutely everything we can. And we can resell now. That's too bad. How fun would that have been to get that Excelsior right off the bat? Basically by by cheesing one of these basic uh, mechanics that we saw. Got a lot of money out of that though, so I'm very pleased by that. Alright, go back. Let's see if we can't refit our, this vessel first with what we just got. Before we start filling up, what can we put on here? We definitely need some point defense. They have very little point defense. Synergy mounts. A couple small energy up front. The large energy are certainly what I want to be seeing, though. Two tachyon lasers are hard to beat. You know, proximity charges might be might be fun. Little mini blasters, yeah, defense too. Hold on. What else we got? So there's wasps, they'll be our point defense essentially. Uh, dedicated targeting core, let's get hardened sub shields, hardened subsystems, reinforced bulkhead. Nope, hardened subsystems is gone, so we can trade it out for vents. And. We're gonna build in the reinforced bulkhead. I do not wanna lose this vessel. Yeah, I think that'll be okay. Let's go ahead and consider our options. After we do a quick repair, we're gonna aid. We're just gonna send the Zenith then. Oh, 
Zenith is a lot of fun. This is like a giant monitor. I mean, it's not as good as a monitor. Ah, oh, they already did it. That's too bad. Alright. Purified Transplutonics and Compound. Some of the new items along with Purified Transplutonic Ore. And Integrated Components. I quite like this, like, uh, the industry light sort of item here. Okay. Expanded Crew Deck. Uh, expanded Magazines. I think we do want to buy the Expanded Magazines. Mostly for, for later, though. Do we have any ships in here that'd be worth buying? These little hectates are nasty little little fighters if you can get them right. Let's make sure we have enough crew. And now we've really got to see if we can't. Yeah, join battle order second command. Just go ahead and get what you can out of it. Not a whole lot, obviously. Salvage real quick. Nope. All right, that was good. That was a good start. No, we don't want your your credits. Sorry. Is there anything else? Okay, so we've got a a couple options in here now. Let's go ahead and get rid of capacitors and vents just so we can see what we have available. Zero point defense. We haven't really been in the game long enough for the markets to, to catch up. So it doesn't surprise me. Alright, so we're just going to have to rock with what we got right now. Which means these little guys are just going to be garbage for a little while. Yeah, you, th these guys aren't going to be anything right now. We'll put some swarmers on them. Give them max capacitors. Give them a... We don't have expanded missile racks, do we? We don't. Okay. That's an issue. Do we have... Expanded missile racks or something here. Advanced optics, phase anchor, and ECCM package. Honestly, yeah, the ECCM package, we're going to want that. Get us as much cash as we can. We're going to tick some people off having done that. But I'm okay with it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We already have our commission. We got what we want out of it. I feel pretty comfortable selling on the black market to people we already have a commission with, because we're going to be killing enough enemy fleets, pirates, leg path, whatever, in order to uh, make it viable. Okay, so we've got got some options back here now. We'll give them the IR pulse lasers. Give them max capacitors too. No, sorry, vents, not capacitors. ECCM package should make should make those little let's see what else could we give them we could give them hardened subsystems now let's just max out the vents for now yep ECCM package for the swarmers And then bam. Do we have anything better here? No, we still don't. Uh, I'd rather leave the Typhon on him, honestly. 
this is this is more of a long range support vessel. But I don't know if I want to take off its its uh its close range capacities right now. I could though. Give them pelumps. It would be essentially uh a support boat. We could get rid of the unstable injectors then. Give it ECCM. Yeah, let's do that. And now it'll be essentially a missile boat. Do we want harpoons? I don't think we want harpoons. I don't think we want anything else off I mean on this right now. How's our fleet? We look fine. We have a lot of ordnance points, but it's to be expected. Let's we'll see if we can't go harass the pirates just a little bit. Speed that up. Not too fast, though. As soon as just, yeah, here we go. Now we should be seeing some pirate fleets. Got him. No, we don't want either ship. We do want to try to track down as many of these little fleets as we can. Be really nice to get them all together. Yes. Our tachyon lances are apparently on, uh... Yeah, no, I don't like that. Our tachyon lances are on auto-fire. I'm okay with that. We move really slow. There's a little... Yeah, let's see if we can't get the uh, little hectates to be flying after that hound. Go ahead and get them, wasps. Nice. Easy peasy. I mean, it's easy peasy because, I mean, look at the ship we, we got right off the bat. Okay, good. Let's head back to Echo Bress. We're getting the system bounty and everything with it still, and that relation is still improving. This, the relation's not even going to be an issue. We can sell black market whenever we want, as long as we don't have anything that we don't want the uh, inspection teams to be taken away from us. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Sell, 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 sell. We'll keep these because I think we'll need them at some point. Let's see what other ships they've got. Ooh, hoo, hoo. The Sunder U's are great. I really enjoy these high-tech Sunders. Yeah, still nothing really... I mean, we could do the Atropos, but I think the Tachyon lasers will take care of that for the most part. Let's take the... Let's link the... Tachyon lasers. We should probably replace the frontal IR pulse with point defense as soon as we have the ability. But I think we're, we're probably good for right now. The the hectates. I think they have a f oh the high energy focus. I was wrong. I thought they had a flare system. All right. Let's see what we've got moving around bounty wise. We are still eight days away from this bounty being toast. But if we want, we could probably go take out these guys. Uh, Irradiated World in the TSR system. Uh, do we have enough fuel? Yes, we do. We have a decent amount of supplies, too. I think we'll be okay.
And yeah, we can chain off a transponder. Uh, get us out of the storm. Lytic Pilgrims. Interesting. I think that comes from the more more missions. Let's see. Radiated World. That's them. We're not going to be able to do any surveying, but we should be able to take out these guys' fleet pretty easily. I'm here. Got him. Yeah, that shouldn't be a problem either. We'll just take uh, myself and the extra officer we have. Uh, we took a little damage from the asteroid field. We don't have any point defense, but we do have wasps. And they're, they're essentially point defense. We'll just yeet these mines at this dude. Even while he's doing his flak, it's fine. Oh! Forgot how fast tachyons use up our abilities. <laughs> Let's pull back just a little. <laughs> Okay, so proximity mines, terrible range. Ah, I just want this over. Bring the hectates in. Yep. Launch flares, and we're good. I guess we didn't even need them. Yep, salvage. Uh, let's take a look at that abandoned research base. We should be able to get... Oh, we should be able to get something out of them. Also looks like our officer got promoted, which is good. Oh, wait a second. Meta research space docking resembles loose comp. Okay, so it's not what I thought. Let's go ahead and do a circle around the sun. Not really picking up anything. Yeah, okay, nothing, nothing truly special here, it looks like. Alright, let's head back into our mainland, and we are... Are we at war with the Persian League? No, we are not. Okay. So we can definitely... Move in here. To Salamanca, to hopefully grab some... Good lord. We're not even using our, our burn. Now we are, though. All right. Yep, we got to turn that transponder on if we want to be trading. This a lot of loader? Yes, please. Integrated point defense AI. Man, nah, whatever. Do we have point defense? Yes, we do. Okay, that's all I care about right now. Let's see. Let's take... Uh, we'll leave these on for now.
There we go. Missile auto loader. Wait a second. Oh, that's right. It doesn't work with like um synergy mounts, right? Of course. Well, that's fine. All right, so we are mostly a, a fun little gunboat now. We have a little cash, but I'm not seeing anything I really want to pick up. What about in the... Nope, we are not going to be delivering. Uh, decline that too. Not, not worth those. Nope, sorry, we don't have a colony. I apologize. No, we can't be doing any raids either. Alright, let's, uh... Let's see if we can't get involved in a couple battles real quick. There we go. Put defense on our zenith. Wasps kind of harass this little Nautilus over here. Nice. Let's gravitate towards the right. Start launching mines. Well, heck, Tate, what are you doing trying to get blown up? Also, I just realized our wasps are not following us. There we go. You're next. The mines are really interesting close range. Yep. Alright, we should be able to take out the rest of this fleet pretty quick now. Let's go ahead and just vent while we try to pull back just a little. We got really good armor. Uh, yep. Start launching mines. See if we can't knock. Yeah, there it goes. Just about done. Been real quick. Our guys aren't doing a very good job staying on top of us to protect us, are they? And they're wasting our tachyons, which is annoying. So let's go ahead and switch the tachyons to manual. did that for fun. Why not? Alright, just claim victory. We can pursue him. Wow, that almost filled our cargo hold right up. Alright, let's, let's sell some of this uh, garbage real quick. Pursuing our fleet? Why? Yeah, allow scan. Get out of here. How annoying. It's not like we're trying to sell things on the black market or nothing. Actually, give me those back. And... Yeah, perfect. Alright, let's head back over to Bristle. 
Going to hit Coolin. And now that we've got another point, let's go ahead and add it into our ship. We need to be a little faster with our Zenith. It won't give us a huge boost, but it'll give us something that'll that'll uh, be workable. Nice. Let's hit uh, Echo Breast first. I can't remember what had the uh, the little wonderful Sunder under it. That's not a bad looking. Yeah, that wasn't bad looking. But let's let's see what we can pilfer from the other Tritachion base real quick. Okay, so they must have sold it. But that's fine. Yeah, point fence, lasers, yep, yep, yep. Missiles, yeah, yeah, that's all fine. Oh, man. Yeah, I want the auto pulse. I hate to say it, but auto pulse is just really nice. And if that's the case, we need to pump a little bit more into our flux, too. We'll keep... Ooh, flare Burst Launch System releases missiles loaded with auto launch seekers to destroy enemy missiles while scrambling guidance systems. Ah, uh, it's okay. Uh, burst PD and the long range PD should be more than enough to keep our front, front safe. But you know what we could do? We could do all Burst PD up front and just absolutely annihilate anything that gets close. And leave the long range PD. I think this is gonna be fine. We'll we'll just stick with what we've got right now. Let's see if they've got an integrated targeting system for us. Flux, phase anchor. Accelerated shields. No, okay, so we're fine. We're gonna hold on to the tachyon lasers because I have a feeling we will want them at some point. Uh, I can't remember who our contact was. It must have been at the other dock. We'll see if we have any ships here we can buy. Uh, look at that. Would be nice. Uh, Brawlers, Tempest, Omens, all look good. Fury, Harbinger is a lot of fun, especially with those, um, those plasma throwers. I like Brawlers. Usually good standoff ships. They can take a little bit of beating. Let's, yeah, let's go ahead and head back over to Echo Bress. I feel like we'll have a little bit better purchasing power over here. Mm, you know what? Not a whole lot. You know, I will think about it. A couple of these ships really, really tempt me, like the Tempests. They're a lot of fun. Uh, but we also have a Fury, the Vulture. Uh, a couple other items that could be pretty good for us. Uh, but I think they'll be good for us. We haven't encountered the Hive yet, uh, but they are coming eventually. Uh, like, share, subscribe, comment down below. But until next time, thanks for joining me.